So now let's, um, we're going to look at some more of these statements with multiple quantifiers. But before I do that, I'm going to define a term. So the reciprocal, this should be something you probably heard of before, the reciprocal of a real number A is a real number B such that when I take and multiply A and B together, I get one. So we're gonna rewrite some statements formally. Every non-zero real number has a reciprocal. So the first thing you want to do is identify which quantifier should you lead off with. Well, here you're talking about every, so you're going to start with for every, and then what? It's for all non-zero real numbers. And I'm going to give it a variable name. Let's go with u. And then which type of quantifier should appear next? Well, has a reciprocal. So you hear you're talking about at least one. So then that means you're talking about existential. There exists a real number V such that, and then what does it mean to be reciprocal? It means U times V would have to be equal to one. Let's look at one more of these. There is a real number with no reciprocal. So identify again your starting quantifier there is. So existential, there is a real number C such that for all, okay, so then what, what does it mean to have no no reciprocal means if I take any number, so for all real numbers D, when I multiply them, I don't get one back. So don't forget, again, order matters here. Identify what is your starting quantifier and then what your secondary quantifier is after that.